are booting up Windows 10 PC. Hmm. S same boot up as Windows 7, obviously. And I'm running this on uh, vir Virtual PC 2007 SP1. So it's gonna work. We're gonna wait for this to boot up and let's see what it looks like. Ooh, Windows and PC. Windows and PC. If you hear that background noise, I that's my TV. Volume is up so loud. Sorry about that. So it boots up a bit slowly because this um, virtual machine is running at uh, 351 megabytes of RAM, I think. Ooh, we have a new wallpaper. Nice. And it says Windows Thin PC at the bottom. This is a nice wallpaper. Look at that. Oh, okay, there we go. Well, this is Windows Thin PC. Still, I can't click on anything. Ah. Oh. Sorry about this, but my camera, not camera, my screen recording software is interfering with the virtual machine. So every time I click, it doesn't work. So um, I'm so sorry about this. So I'm just going to keep pausing and then showing you around Windows 10 PC. So then it's going to work. So um, be right back. So. I'm so sorry about this. Well, um, we have Inner Explorer 8 here. We have Windows Explorer and Windows Media Player. And we have no sound. That sucks. Oh, yeah. If you're wondering why there's a watermark right there, um, yeah. This copy of Windows is not activated. You cannot, and I mean, you cannot right now activate um, Windows 10 PC because it's still in its um, uh, evaluation and um, stage. So you cannot activate it. So you only have like 30 days to um, uh, use this operating system. So I am so sorry, Microsoft. Once again, you have disappointed your customers okay so be right back okay we're looking at the start menu wow <laughs> we don't have a, a lot of programs here wow subsystem for unix based applications startup maintenance accessories Windows Update, uh, Windows Media Player, Internet Explorer 8, and default programs. As you can see, I cannot click, as I said earlier, so I have to keep pausing. Um, so I'll be right back again. Oh, oh yeah, as you can see, there's no list. Wow. Okay, the watermark down here. It says um, Windows Embedded Evaluation Copy Build 7601. Hmm. Yeah. I think it's something 
developed in invented stage. I got no idea what they came up with. So we are back once again. Ah, oh, lots of pausing. As you can see, Win versus um, Windows Thin PC, of course, Microsoft Windows version 6.1 build 7601 service pack 1 copyright two 2010 Microsoft Corporation registered to me and it's an evaluation copy of course so it ends on October 31st 2011 at 8 o'clock 8 o'clock 7.59 yeah course I can't click so um yeah. yeah I I gave this virtual machine um 64 gigs of uh, hard drive space and look 61.2 gigabyte is free Wow huh <laughs> two gigs two gigs used hardly ever here's a DVD drive right here and um yeah I'll be right back once again uh, as you can see I wasn't lying um I gave this virtual machine 350 megabytes of RAM and uh available is uh, 103 and it's almost used up so hmm good memory usage if you come up with one gig so there you go um yeah so uh, so that's a task manager for you for Windows 10 PC. Not a lot of memory usage for your, um, you know, older computers. So we are back once again. Okay, I'm back. And um, here's the system properties. Here's something different. Yeah, something's different. Here it is Windows Embedded Standard. Copyright 2010, Microsoft Corporation, Service Pack 1. And here's one thing that caught my attention. Processor, AMD Turion 64X2 running at 7 megahertz. <laughs> oh, what the heck? I don't know what to say about that. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, okay. It's just a virtual machine. That's it. Install memory, 351 megabytes of RAM. 32 bit operating system. Um, it's not a tablet, of course. My name. And this is what happens if you click on 30 days to activate. Activate Windows now. Don't mind about that product key. Well, be right back. I always forget that I don't, I can't, I cannot click. So this is what happens if you click on 30 days to activate, activate Windows now. Yeah, that's right. You cannot activate it. As I said earlier, you cannot activate it. And if you click on system rating is not available, it does not do anything. When you click on it, it does not do anything does not open a thing a single thing so Windows experience index is probably not on here so yeah who would you use this for rating and gaming and uh, arrow for this um, operating system so uh, yeah there you go so I'll be right back again oh yeah I almost forgot um, the run and search field is disabled in the start menu. So what the heck? That's how I got. Uh. Uh. What is that called? That's how I got curious on how to open a uh, Winver. Yeah, that's that's what I was saying. So that reminded me to open up command prompt. So, uh, 
I'm gonna open up Windverse, so yeah. There is no search field. Wow. Okay, these are all the applications that um Windows 10 PC provides you with. Um as I said earlier, um Mirror Explorer, Windows Media Player, Windows Update. Here's the accessories. Uh command prompt connect to a projector so you can see it to all your uh friends who are viewing your desktop. So we have remote desktop connection, we have run. They just put it here, run. Sound recorder, Windows Explorer, ease of access, system tools, Windows PowerShell, maintenance, help and support, uh, Windows Remote Assistant. So there you go. That's all the programs it comes with. But it, oh yeah, what, one more thing. It, it does come with the Windows 7 themes, but Arrow does not get enabled, of course. So you can just use them whenever you want. Uh, I don't know if you can still download the, the themes off the website. Yeah, I think you can, but uh, just for 30 days, of course. Then the trial becomes deactivated and it won't work. Hmm. So I guess that is it. Pretty much all the applications are the same from Windows 7, but huh, it doesn't come with any games, so yeah, there you go. Yeah, uh, yeah, I think that's pretty much it for Windows 10 PC. So now, um, let's shut it down. So we are okay, it's shutting down and there is the awesome wallpaper. I think it's nice. And there's Windows 10 PC at the bottom. Pretty much the same splash screen for Windows 7. It's a different wallpaper. Okay, so you have seen Windows 10 PC. So I hope you have enjoyed this video and if you want to test it, you can go to Microsoft's Connect website and register an account there if you don't have an account you cannot download it so that's one disadvantage so I cannot provide you with the download link or else I'm gonna violate their terms of use so you have to do it yourself and download it from their website so sorry about that so there you go that you have seen um, a Windows thin PC demonstration me um, looking at Windows thin PC this will be this is a very helpful operating system for those older computers so yeah you can try this out for yourself at Microsoft's Connect website so thanks for watching and uh, goodbye